The Adama local government chairman has vowed to see that Atiku does not succeed in his presidential race. I can imagine what that means. But according to their own reason, they said they've already pledged their allegiance to the APC and Atiku has no choice but to support their candidate, which is Tsunumbu. According to the chairman, they recall during 1999 when Atiku brought in Upper Sanjo for them to vote for him. Now, according to their word as well, they are saying that this is high time for Atiku to accept this and also vote for Tinumbu. <laughs> this is funny, but I will leave that for you to give your opinion. Moving on to entertainment news, last week was all about the crash of Akindele's marriage. So, according to a Twitter post, this person said that if you are marrying a successful woman, be sure to have a lot of things going on out there. I mean, be sure to be also successful, else they will throw you out. <laughs> That's some kind of intense statement. But Tools has also come out to give her own opinion based on all the stuff that has been going on on social media. So Tools came out to tweet that it is now the fault of Funke Akindele because she is a successful woman. We can't actually tell because we don't stay in their house. She also asked, added sarcastically that as a woman, please don't be successful. <laughs> now that is actually sarcastic, but that's the narrative. I mean, it is so hard for us to accept successful women, irrespective of the fact that we love to see them, but the narrative is so biased. I would actually love to know your own opinion based on this ranging issue. Don't forget to leave your comments, like and share this. I still remain your humble old girl, Jessica Chingwen.